Shaw in the on-deck circle. As the payoff pitch is swung on and missed, and J.J. Hoover gets a huge strikeout to get the crowd on their feet. Striking out four times. But here gets a hold of one in the left field, and Correa around the bases. Christian Correa gets the home team on the board and brings the fans to their feet. How about the hitting by Correa? We were talking about the 0 for 5 performance on Saturday. He'll wipe that one out of our minds with a solo home run and get the Legends on the board here in the bottom of the third. Here for the Legends. And Silverio chops one deep in the hole. It's short. Frias, a nice defensive play, but Silverio able to beat out the throw, and he's safe at first. I believe Hugh Davis will score that a base hit. He will. No, I was not with the Legends at that okay. time. I was here in Lexington. Going is Silverio. No throw down and an easy advance over to second base for the Legends' third baseman. The pitch. And Juan back up the middle. Base hit. One run will come in. They're going to wave. Baldequin around as Powell will throw home. And safe is Roberto Baldequin. And Silverio going to be out between first and second. The 0-2. And a swing and a miss for Shaw as he goes to 0 for 4 in the game. But the damage is done. A two-run shot. Phipps at second and the 1-2 pitch. Revere in the right field. That'll be a base hit. It'll drive in the go-ahead run. I just talked about how Revere loved to pull it down the right field line. And where does he go? Down the right field line to give the Legends a one-run lead in the eighth inning. Thompson, the payoff pitch. Baldwin, a base hit. Revere will round third. Powell loses it in center field. And Revere will tack on a run as Baldwin will round second and find himself over at third. Roberto Baldwin makes it 5-3. Legends in front. Chance to get an RBI. Here's the 2-2 again. And this time in the left field, Ford can't get to it. Make that. Mazzilli can't get to it. And Juan Silverio drives in Baldequin to give the Legends a three-run lead. Gives the sign and the 2-2. Swing and a miss. Kelly down on strikes. Legends one out away from... A victory in game three. The 2-2. It's going to be hit right to Silverio, and the Legends are one win away from an ALCS championship here in Lexington. Legends, six. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Legends, six. And the Ducks, three. And that will set up a game four here in Lexington tomorrow where the Legends will have a chance to pick up a championship in their first year in the Atlantic League. Sets and delivers the one-two. And a pitch of the knees will ring up Lombar Dozy as he goes down looking for strike three and two outs now in the inning. Westcott with the striped socks on the night will set and deliver the 0-2 pitch. And down goes Ford. Westcott paints the corner perfectly. We got three outs in the inning. Frias will be stranded over at second. 1-1 to Hawkins. Iorio sets and Hawkins in the left center field. That one's going back. The Hawk will soar one over the left center field wall to get us on the board early. Hawkins will round the bases and in the bottom of the first with two outs, the Legends take a one to nothing lead here at home in game four of the ALCS. Courtney Hawkins, folks. We knew it wouldn't be long for him to get going. As Phipps awaits the pitch, again, the 2-2 delivery. This one's hit hard, that one's hitting the left center field and back to back jacks as Phipps goes over the crush zone. And the three and four hitters supplying the power early. Phipps makes it two nothing legends here at home. And Dennis Phipps will trot around the bases. 
as the Legends tack on another one. Back-to-back -back jacks for the Legends left fielder and first baseman. It's 2-0. Good guys on top here in the first. The fourth home run of the postseason for Dennis Phipps. Was one of the top hitters in the Atlantic League all year long as well. Was the first hitter to get to 100 hits in the regular season. And he'll get aboard here with one of those hits as he gets one in the left field. Mazzilli gets it in quickly as Baldwin gets aboard with a leadoff single. Bats here with a 1-0 count and one on in the bottom half of inning number two. Silverio, base hit again. 1-1 one, one count here to Oklinski. Ben will hit one hard in the left field. That one's going back in. That one is over the wall. Ben Oklinski will Let's go. go over the left field wall for a three-run shot. That's one way to find your swing. Oklinski, who was one of the top five home run hitters all year in the Atlantic League, delivers one over the stash in left field and makes it Five, one legends. That'll bring up Cole Sturgeon. Sturgeon, base hit in the right field. That one will get down, and Sturgeon can run for days as that one's going to get lost in the legends bullpen. Sturgeon will round second and head for third. As Iorio sets and delivers. And Phillips up the middle, a base hit and an RBI for Phillips as he flips the bat and gives the crowd a smile. And the Legends make it six to one here in the second inning. Four runs across for the home team. In the late innings last night, but the Legends were able to answer and got the big win. And now Frias, after coming back to the plate, will swing out or will swing and strike out for the first out of the inning. Four runs in the bottom half of the second inning, and Baldwin will go to the right field here. That one's gonna get down on the base hit for Baldwin the opposite way. Baldwin will round first and head for second and a sliding double as the legend shortstop now two for two tonight. Two balls, two strikes, Westcott back to it and a swing and a miss, Romero down on strikes. Got a 1-0 count here to Sturgeon. Cole in the right field. That's where he went with it, folks. And this one is off the wall. And Sturgeon will hold up at first. All three of his hits have went to right field. And he's now two for three in the ball game. Or two Phillips from Deleon. This one in the right center field will get down as Phillips aboard for the second time tonight. Phillips a huge lead over at first as Deleon delivers the 1-1 one -one to Hawkins. Courtney! Two times tonight, the Hawk has blasted one, and that one's heading way over the left field wall. A three-run shot for Hawkins. Legends nine, Ducks one here tonight in Lexington, folks. We are having a bomb party here at home. The fourth home run of the game for Lexington, the second of the game for Hawkins. Four RBIs for the Hawks, or for the Hawk, and it's 9-1, Legends on top. In the AL League this year, the Atlantic League. This one's hit hard by Revere. Revere going deep over the right field wall and a solo shot for the Legends hitting coats as he celebrates. Revere showing he's still got some, folks. The former Lexington Catholic Knight and former Minnesota Twin Solo shot over the right field wall, and Revere puts the legends in the double digits tonight. It's 10-1, good guys. More action up in the pin now for the Ducks as the 0-2 pitch is hit in that area, in that direction. Silverio will be aboard again. This time it'll be a double for the legends third baseman. As he hits one down the left field line, a base hit as Westcott Winds up and delivers the 0-2 pitch. And a called strike three, Flores down looking. Game number four here, and it's a 10-2 lead as Westcott delivers a 2-2 pitch on the outside corner. Romero down looking. Winds up and delivers. And a swing and a miss by Shaw. Strike him out. How about Westcott tonight? The offense has been dominant, but so has the pitcher for Lexington. Another strikeout for Westcott, his second of the inning. 
And once again, delivers the 2-2 pitch. Hawkins, if twice is nice, three is even better. Once again, the Hawk goes yard. Three home runs in the game for Hawkins as he soars across the bases. And it doesn't matter who you bring in, folks. Hawkins is on fire tonight. That is his third home run of the game. It's now 11 to two Lexington. 1-1 one, one count, this one is grounded. Deep in the hole at second base, Lombard Dozy can't make the play. The speed of Ben Revere. One and zero count to Baldwin. Roberto, hard hit over the left field wall again. Another legend's home run. Bombs away, Roberto Baldwin. A two-run shot. It is 13 to two, folks. There ain't nothing stopping this team from bringing home a title tonight. They are putting it all on display here in Lexington. Dragmeyer the 1 0. That one's going to be hit past Lombardozzi at second, the diving effort for the third time tonight. Cole Sturgeon on board for the Legends. Who's at the plate now with a 2 2 count and two outs? Carson the pitch. Sanchez in the right center field. Cole Sturgeon and Eklinski coming on. And Eklinski, a diving grab in right center field to close out the inning. And a one-two. Swung on and missed. Strike one out. And that's one out in the inning. Gibson sets and delivers. Ford over to Phillips. BP will throw it over to Baldwin. And your legends are legends tonight. Lexington defeats the Ducks 13 to two as the celebration begins in Lexington. And in their first year in the Atlantic League, the legends are champions once again for the fourth time in the history of the franchise. Let's turn this baby over to Microphone Mike. 